Shocking insult to the memory of a local legend. Vandals attacked the grave of native son and world boxing champion Johnny Tapia, who died in 2012. News 13's Brady Wakayama is live with that story. Brady. Dean, this afternoon we spoke to Tapia's widow, Teresa, who said she couldn't believe anyone would do this. It's shocking news because Johnny loves New Mexico and, and I know most people love him. So it was very disheartening that people would go and decide to trash his grave. There have been numerous reports of vandalism at San Jose de Armijo Cemetery near Arnold, southwest where Tapia is buried. Tapia became an Albuquerque legend for his boxing feats. He won multiple world championships in three different weight classes. He overcame multiple bouts with addiction before dying of heart failure in 2012. His funeral was held in the pits. At his gravesite, pictures were burned and destroyed. Numerous glass objects were smashed and a picture of Tapia's mother was stolen. Teresa Tapia says she's frustrated that people would do such a thing. This shows a lack of respect. I mean, Johnny fought hard his whole life and like I said, he loved New Mexico and most people here are great, so it's very just discouraging to know that there's people out there that don't have the respect for him. Tapia does not have any leads on who might have wanted to do this damage. She says people have already reached out on social media showing their support. Tapia says the incident is very unfortunate but believes her husband's legacy will never be untouched and will carry on throughout the community and the world. Dean, back to you. All right, Brady, thank you. It has been a rough 24 hour for the Tapia family. Teresa says her son was also shot last night and is in the hospital right now.